Hey, we back. I'm here with a robot this time. Um, and we've done a lot of videos on all the different things that you can do in a robot. Well, I don't know if we've done all of them, probably not, but you know, in the future anyway. Um, what about what you can't do? Hmm? Considered that. Um, now, obviously, there are a lot of things that you can't do in a robot. Um, I mean, for example, I, I can't claim zero two, you know. That's a, that's a Madeo only thing. Oh, it's doing this again, is it? Okay. It always changes who actually is zero two. There you go. It's the Kirby one at the moment. Oh dear. Yeah, you can't claim zero two in, in a robot. Um, but in terms of relevant things, there are actually a lot of things that you can't do that people don't realize you can't do. Um, so that's what I'm going through today. Uh, the first one on our little list um, is the one that I actually get asked about quite a lot, um, which is gems. Uh, in your inventory here, we have gems. These gems. Uh, what you can't do with gems, you can't unequip them. When you're doing your hunts, right? You've got your hunts here. If you equipped gems, you equip them with Oro Equip. You cannot unequip them. Um, you have to let them run out completely, which, you know, will happen eventually, and then you can equip a different one. Uh, but yes, you cannot actually unequip them. Um, speaking of gems, gem animals, in fact, uh, you cannot get gem animals on Huntbot. Uh, this is another thing that people don't seem to realize. Uh, we've got the gem animal tier here. Uh, the amount of gem animals you get is increased by your level of lucky gem. And the description of the lucky gem says that the percentage chance for gem animal uh, being hunted is increased. Uh, but that is basically from zero. I don't actually know if it is strictly from zero, but I'm pretty sure it's from zero. Um, the point is, when you're on Huntbot, you obviously don't have a lucky gem equipped. It doesn't use your gems on Huntbot. So you cannot get gem animals on Huntbot at all. Uh, by the same um, principle, you can't get bot animals on manual hunts, but that one's a lot more obvious. Yeah, you will never get a gem animal on a Huntbot. Um, and again, on the vein of gems, actually, um, Another uh, animal that you can't get uh, is Patreon animals. Uh, now this may be obvious, obviously, it, it, unless you've got Patreon. Um, you cannot get them without Patreon. This may seem obvious, uh, but back in the day there was Patreon gems. You may have heard of them, um, hence why I have a Patreon animal. And you can't get the gems anymore. You can't get the Patreon animals anymore. But that used to be a thing. Uh, indeed, uh, speaking of things that you cannot get anymore, we have runes. Uh, rune is a, a pretty great weapon. I've got my rune here, uh, my six-digit code rune, epic and cool. Uh, you cannot get these anymore. Uh, you also can't sell runes if you do have one, uh, but I, if you've got one, I assume you know that, to be fair. Uh, me being me sold my rune anyway uh, before they actually put that in. Uh, big brain. Uh, but yes, you can't get runes anymore, the same as you can't get Patreon gems. Uh, so if you have heard about them, I assume you knew that, but might as well put them on the list because it is true that you cannot get those two things anymore. Um, on a slight diversion now, we've been reasonably consistent going through all of this. Um, but uh, let's go on to making some money. Selling stuff, perhaps. Uh, we, we can go from gems. Selling gems, that's not a thing. These gems up here that I mentioned, let's bring up the menu again at the bottom, shall we? Uh, you can't sell them. You can't sell gems. Uh, in fact, you can't sell most of the stuff in your inventory. You can't sell gems, you can't sell loot boxes, you can't sell wallpapers, uh, and I'm pretty sure you can't sell rings either. You know the, the rings in the shop? Uh, front page, I think. Yeah, there we go. You can't sell these either, only buy them. Uh, the only thing, in fact, that you can sell in your inventory is weapons. You can sell weapons. Uh, they don't sell very well, and I would advise you dismantle them instead for shards, because shards are a lot more useful. But you can sell weapons if you want. I used to sell a lot of weapons before I knew about weapon shards, um, but that's another matter. Yeah, other than the weapons, though, you can't sell anything uh, from inside your infantry. Although, speaking of weapons, uh, you cannot uh, sell or dismantle uh, in uh, all of your weapons at once. So if you, you know, I, I've got my 28 weapon crates here. If I want to dismantle all of them, there is not a command for that. Uh, what there is a command for is dismantling all of a certain type. So I could do uh, dismantle, say, 
uh, uncommon uh, weapons like that, um, and I can in indeed I can shorten it uh, to um, UW for uncommon weapons, or you know whatever rarity you like. You know you can do that, um, but you cannot do dismantle all. That's actually not a thing. Pretty sure. Um, I mean that literally isn't. <laughs> It'll assume you're talking about an ID if you put something like that. Um, so yes, as far as I'm aware, you can't do them all at once. Um, you can do individual weapons using IDs, obviously, before I discovered about the uncommon weapons and such list, I was also, you know, dismantling all my weapons by IDs, which is super fun, but oh well, moving along from that. Um, and uh, yes, along with the, uh, the money-making schemes, what else can you not do with money? Uh, you cannot get over a thousand from your daily. Uh, uh, most people probably know this, um, but yeah, your OO daily, you start off with what, about like 250 currency? I'm not actually sure how much you start off with, you know, when you collect your one daily. And then the point is, as your streak goes up, you get more and more money, right? But it does have a cap at a thousand, so if you have never hit that cap, I suppose you would never know that. But yes, that has a cap of a thousand, you can't go above a thousand on it. Um, you hit that at about 30 days, I think, it's something like that. Um, what doesn't have a cap is your voting. Your voting doesn't have a cap. If you've uh, noticed, your voting actually goes up as well, and you don't even need a streak for that, but that goes up very slowly, so it's going to take a long time to get that over a thousand. Um, but yes, your daily has a cap of a thousand, so you're not getting more than that. Um, a fun one that, uh, that a lot of people don't realize, or more likely don't care about, um, gambling. You cannot make consistent profit with gambling. Hate to break it to you guys, but it's just not something you can do. Uh, we've talked about this many times before. If we go over the types of gambling, uh, we've got coin flip. That's a 50-50 chance. You're not making a consistent uh, profit. Uh, we've got slots. That's a 47.5% chance of winning. Uh, so, yeah, you're not making consistent profit with that. In fact, you are making a consistent loss. So that's fun. Uh, we also have uh, Blackjack. I, uh, as I've said before, don't actually know the exact percentages on Blackjack, so I guess harass me. Um, but as I have also said before, Blackjack is like an actual card game played in casinos. If you could make a consistent profit of it, damn, I would be heading straight to a cons casino, you know that much. Uh, so yeah, Blackjack also isn't going to be getting you money. Uh, long story short, gambling, not consistent profit. That's not to say that you can't profit of it. You absolutely can. I mean, watch me, watch me right now. Uh, watch me, coin flip a thousand. Be ready for this. Profit. <laughs> oh, if that had been tails, I had to re-record the whole thing. <laughs> Uh, now, to be fair, you can actually make reasonably consistent profit on the coin flip, because let's say that had been tails, I could do a, a double down here, uh, go for 2,000, and then keep doubling down until I won, and the chances of winning, pretty high, not gonna lie. Uh, but it's not 100%, and what you stand to gain is 1,000, what you stand to lose is all the way up into the limit of 50,000, and the percentages work out. You're not making a consistent profit. In the end, you are just as likely to lose as you are to win. So it's not consistent. But yeah, making a small profit on something like a coin flip is indeed very easy. If you want a quick thousand currency, as long as you have maybe a hundred thousand to burn, uh, then making one thousand is really easy. Uh, but yes, it, it realistically doesn't help you all too much, and it is not consistent profit. So yeah, that's another thing that you can't do in a robot. What else can't you do? Let me have a look at my list. You can't max radar on your hunt bot. Radar does not have a max. Well, I hear actually that it does have a max of 999, if you're wondering. Um, but funnily enough, no one has hit that. No one has hit anywhere near it. And to be perfectly honest, I think if someone did get somewhere near it, it's more likely that Scuttler would just increase it again, you know? Uh, so... Yeah, you can't you can't max radar either. You can max everything else. Obviously, as you can see, I have maxed everything else. Uh, my radar is not a particularly high level uh, because I don't really hunt, you know, or sacrifice animals <laughs> for that matter. So yes, my my hunt bot is not 
uh, very great for the amount of time that I've spent on it. But yeah, radar is not something you can max, so there you go. Don't worry about, about <laughs> not having it. Uh, to be fair, radar doesn't make a whole lot of difference anyway, so you don't need to worry about it, absolutely. Um, what else can't you do? You can't use luck for anything. We have our, our curses and our praise. I can curse my day up in here, get me some more luck, get my day some more curse. It's not doing anything. There you go. I've got oh, three and a three and a half thousand luck points. And if I go on the curse leaderboard, my day has five and a half thousand curse. Whoa, epic. Uh, but yes, it's completely useless. Just for the leaderboard. That's all it does. Uh, you cannot use your luck for anything. It does imply, by calling it luck points, that it would increase your luck, maybe give you better animals, or perhaps, since we have a lucky gem, perhaps luck increases the chance of a gem animal, or, you know, all manner of things, but... Nope, it, it doesn't. Not, not even in the gambling, nothing. It, it does nothing, unfortunately. It's just for the leaderboard. Um, I'm pretty sure it's the only leaderboard that is literally useless. There are a lot of leaderboards that are basically useless. I mean, for example, if we just look at the generic Oro one, um, saying Oro oh, oh, 15,000 times, I mean, that's not even that much, to be perfectly honest. Um, but yeah, I mean, this doesn't really mean anything, but technically you get, I think, two currency every time you say Oro. So that's a whole 30,000 currency that I've got over the years from saying that. Wow, stonks. Um, so, not completely useless, uh, but yes, I mean, if you want more information on leaderboards, I already have a video about that, so you can go and watch that one, uh, but I, as off the top of my head, this is the only one that is completely useless, so, yeah, luck, useless. And uh, the final one for today, since uh, this video has gone on longer than I expected already, um, is the one that everyone seems to forget. Oh dearie me, we get plenty of people on my Discord server asking about this one, and they are in a tight spot because the final one is that you cannot trade currency for real money. Do not try it. It is against the terms of service of the bot, and you will get yourself banned. Uh, real money includes, in fact, any real items, uh, gifting Nitro, YouTube Premium, whatever your trading is, it's not allowed, so don't try it. <laughs> um, but yes, that one should be fairly obvious. It should be fairly obvious. Just, uh, people seem to forget that they accepted the terms of service when they started using the bot, I suppose. Whoopsies! Anyway, we're done now. And that is all of the things that I could think of that you cannot do in a robot. If you have any more to list, feel free to put them in the comments, and perhaps I will notice them. <laughs> anyway, bye!